What's up, everyone? Welcome to the Power Play with CJ Prospect Profiles. We're focusing on Cody Glass, 2017 draft eligible center, coming to you from the Portland Winterhawks, the Western Hockey League. Uh, six foot two, 180 pound pivot that was uh, instrumental in Portland's uh, success this season. 94 points in 69 um, regular season games, 32 goals, 62 assists, and then nine points in 11 playoff games. Uh, obviously, you don't get the ideal size to be an NHL center because. You know, the, the middle of the ice is getting bigger and bigger in terms of the players you're plugging in there. And uh, at 6'2 and 180 pounds and time to fill out his frame, I think he'll be a, you know an ideal um, NHL center in terms of size. His speed is the only thing that stands out. One of the faster guys you're going to see, you know, the higher end part of the draft. Um, and, you know, between his speed, size, and hockey, I can many wins battles and is able to, to create for himself and for his teammates. And, uh, you know, that's, that's made him, again, one of the top – scoring draft eligible players in the CHL this season. Um, you know, and again, he, he's, I think, going to be a top 15 pick, rated out in between 7 and 16. Um, you look at some of the teams picking, you know, in that range, you know, whether it's Buffalo or, or is it L.A., Carolina, Florida, you know, they, they could all take the uh, – they, they would all happily add, you know, a player like this to their, you know, cupboard. Of, uh, of assets. Um, I also, I think his downside intrigues me too, because I, I think he's got the NHL upside to be, you know, top two center, um, you know, at the pro level, but his downside isn't that bad, I think, because of his size, speed, and acumen. He, if he does, if his offensive game doesn't translate, he will be one hell of an energy line center, particularly with the way puck possession is predicated upon in today's game. Um, you know, being an energy center is a lot more than, you know, dumping the puck in and grinding. You know, there's – you need that speed. You need that skill. And I think, honestly, if that offense, you know, doesn't come from the dub to the NHL with him, I, there's still a, a good spot for him. And he will be a very good NHL player for a long time. Definitely a guy to keep an eye on during the draft process and, uh, you know, throughout the next few years. And I think he'll be an instrumental part in Canada um, – for Canada at the World Juniors next year. Again, I think he's going to fill a nice void there, and I think that that'll be where you see how good of an energy player he is. Because again, he's you know pretty high end scorer for Portland uh, this past season, and you know his first year up there, 15, 16, 27 points, 65 games. So he did you know play a little bit of a limited role, um, but you know he's a he's a talented kid, and I think he's going to have a, find a nice role for himself at the NHL level. I think his game is you know really well suited for the way it's, uh, the game of hockey's going these days. Anyway, that's all I got sort of the power play with CJ. Stay tuned for episodes for the season and beyond. Later, guys.